a wounded cop leaves the hospital in a wheelchair, applauded by his brother officer. But the teenager accused of shooting him is already free. Cameron Williams, known as C Blue, is a rapper who used the money he made from a record deal to post $250,000 bail. Look, he defiantly fanned a fistful of $100 bills while making an obscene gesture. Mayor Eric Adams, who gave a eulogy at the funeral today for slain police officer Jason Rivera, says he is outraged that a repeat offender accused of shooting at a police officer is today walking free on bond. It is further proof that our current system is failing us. And it looks like these cops have had enough of the shoplifting epidemic engulfing New York and other big cities. Two officers try to subdue a 45-year-old suspected shoplifter in a Marshalls discount store. Back. The suspect appears to reach for one officer's gun. He manages to get free, but he is arrested outside the store. The incident comes after so many brazen shoplifters have walked away with their loot unchallenged. It's time something happened. It's great the cops got involved. The stores have to take it more seriously because it does often involve violence. And talk about brazen. This suspect was caught on camera allegedly stealing a 70-inch TV from a Target store in Seattle. No way can he slip this giant screen under his jacket, but he doesn't seem to care. It's reportedly the 22nd time in just three months he has stolen items from the same store. He actually engages in a tug of war with security guards and wins. If you want to stop the shoplifting in Seattle and anywhere else that this is happening in such huge numbers, you actually have to enforce the law. You have to make arrests. You have to make it clear that you will, in fact, prosecute people. 55-year-old John Ray Lomack was arrested later. But get this, he was released without bail.